Hi, hello, my name is Jade and welcome to my channel. Happy Valentine's Day. Today, we are gonna spend Valentine's Day together because I'm alone. Today is actually my husband's birthday and you know what? Just because we're alone, or I'm alone, you might not be alone, but just because I'm alone or you might be alone doesn't mean that we can't celebrate Valentine's Day or feel loved, you know? So we are going to try and celebrate Valentine's Day by ourselves today. And I don't really have much planned. I was gonna take a bath to do some self care, but not really sure if I'm feeling that anymore. I'm thinking about making some cookies and uh, making a cake because my husband comes home soon. So I want to make him a cake so when he gets home he will have a cake and I can sing him happy birthday because I'm weird like that. So uh, I'm thinking about baking today because I love baking. But other than that I don't really have much else that I want to do. I don't really have many things, many self-care things in my house. Um, yeah. Other than a bath, like that's the only thing I can think of for self self care. Um, I'm making tea right now. I'm boiling the water so that I can have some tea. What are you doing today? Like, what did you do to celebrate yourself? Because you matter too. I think everyone deserves to celebrate themselves on Valentine's Day because I don't think we love ourselves enough. I know I sure don't. Oh, that reminds me. I gotta take my medicine, but my water's upstairs. So I'm gonna go grab my water. <laughs> okay, I took my medicine and my tea is a steepin. It is steamy. And don't look at my dishes. <laughs> I um, have to do my dishes from making egg salad sandwiches last night. Or just egg salad. I made egg salad so that I could have egg salad sandwiches. Um, yeah, so I'll probably do the dishes at some point today. I don't know exactly when. My legs are hurting really bad, so I'm thinking about sitting down for a little bit and crocheting. I have to work on a Christmas present because I took it apart because I didn't like it. So I'm thinking about doing some self-care as in crocheting for a while and doing that. I'm thinking about maybe putting Gilmore Girls on because I've been really into that again. Or podcast. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I'm trying not to think too much. I only got like one or two messages to my husband yesterday or like last night at midnight to tell him happy birthday and I'm so sad. <laughs> One of his friends, he was talking to his friend, he's like, you guys should name your kid April Valentine. And I was like, why? And he's like, he said that his friend was like, because we're both born on weird holidays. And like, I was like, oh, because <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. He's born on Valentine's Day and I'm born on April Fool's Day. I mean, his holiday is more known than mine is. I mean, my holiday is known, but I wouldn't say that mine's a real holiday. Mine's more like a C grade holiday, while his is a B grade holiday, if you know what I mean. But yeah, I thought it was kind of funny. I was like, we're not naming our kids after us. But funny, I told him that if, when we have kids, that I'm like, listen, we gotta try to make sure their birthdays don't land on other holidays. Cause sharing a birthday with a holiday sucks. We both know that. My holiday sucks. I'm sorry. Everyone, everyone's go-to question for me is, what, are you a joke? You were born on April Fool's Day, so you must be a joke, right? Oh, your parents didn't really want you. That's why you're a joke. I'm just like, yeah. So that's so fun. And he said when we first got together, he's like, oh, I just know that my birthday will never be celebrated because Valentine's Day is more important. And I was like, no, it's not. Your birthday's more important. We can always celebrate Valentine's Day a different day. You're like, your your birthday will be celebrated on your birthday. Sorry, there's um, lawn care. 
going around and the dogs are freaking out. So, yeah. That is our thoughts on our birthdays. So normally I wouldn't be celebrating Valentine's Day on the 14th. Normally it's either the 13th or like the 15th or whenever we decide to. But... This year, I'm gonna celebrate it on the 14th because I'm alone. Celebrate it, you know, acknowledge it and do something to show myself that I love me. And you guys should love you too. I'm just blabbling. Nothing that I'm saying makes any sense. Okay, I'm gonna finish making my tea and start crocheting. Okay, so it's time to make the cake. I'm gonna make the cake before I make cookies because I don't know if I wanna make cookies. <laughs> I have you on my like really crappy tripod, so we'll see how long you stay up. So I'm gonna grab the cake. So he picked German chocolate. Preheat the oven. 350. One cup of water. Half a cup of vegetable oil. Oil. I'm not fancy and I can't crack them with just one hand like a lot of cool people can. I have to use two hands. I use a shad of that. into the thing, but like you can watch my hands, I guess. cake and all his glory all in there. I scraped as much out of there as I could to make sure that it was full. Okay, I want to know when you were younger and your family was making a cake or something, did you get in trouble if you were being like loud or rowdy in the house because you were going to make the cake fall? Or is that just something that I went through? Like, we had to be so quiet in the house. Like you could not talk, like you couldn't jump around. You couldn't be loud. Like the TV had to be super low because if you were too loud or too rowdy or you're jumping around, you were gonna make the cake fall. And it didn't make any sense to me because I was like, how is the cake gonna fall? I don't know. Maybe, maybe my family just told me that because they wanted us to calm down. Who knows? But I'm gonna go ahead and put this in. I will see you guys in, let's see, it says 28 to 33 minutes, so I'm going to go 30 minutes. We'll see you then. So the cake is cooling now. Uh, I took it out and um, I let it cool a little bit on the counter, cool enough that I could flip it off, flip it out of the pan, and then I let it sit on a cooling rack. Um, so yeah. Now I'm just going to let it cool for a few more hours and then um, I'll probably go and I got hair stuck to my lip. I will probably go and uh, frosting, put frosting on it and decorate it. I don't have really anything to decorate it with, but like we're going to put frosting on it and it'll be cool. So 
yeah, I'm just kind of relaxing, reading books, and, you know, watching TikToks, because I'm just going to do what makes me happy today. Yeah, I hope you guys are having a good day. Mine's just a relaxing day. Not putting any pressure on myself to do anything or whatnot. I wanted to make cookies, but I don't want to make a mess. So, we might or we might not. He keeps crawling on me. Let's put some frosting on this bad boy. Now, I'm no like cake decorating expert or anything and the cake's on a cutting board because that's what it fit on. <laughs> so, and uh, yeah, we have coconut pecan for the frosting. That's what he picked out. Yes, he picked out his cake and his frosting. I always let him pick out his cake and frosting. Oh. Doesn't that just look so yummy? <laughs> All right, there it is. The sides are very ugly, but you know what? It's a beautiful cake. Beautiful cake, kind of. I'm proud of it. All right, I'm gonna stick it in the fridge so it can firm up. I'm gonna stick it in the fridge so that the frosting can firm up a little bit. I wanna put this. Oh. I'm just gonna put that over top of it so that it's like covered in the fridge. Yeah, why not? <laughs> All right guys, that's it for Valentine's Day. I'm sorry I didn't do really anything super crazy or super self-care. Honestly, I don't really have anything to do but I'm glad you guys made a cake with me and I hope you guys had a great Valentine's Day I am glad that I decided to just let myself rest and not stress about the cleaning as much as I have been the past two weeks but um yeah thanks for spending Valentine's Day with me and I hope you had a great day and I will see you in the next one bye